Hey guys, Rowan here, and today I bring you my change version of Queen King Happy's Cheap and Compact Brewing Station. The difference between mine and his is that this one lets you brew some of the more hardcore potions that require five ingredients total to make, like the Splash Harming 2 potions and the Elongated Invisibility potions. And so as you can see, my design is pretty similar to his, but some things are changed in it. And just to prove to you guys that it works, I'm going to start it now see just water bottles there and as you can see another work goes in first and the ingredients are lined up correct now I am facing in the west direction I'm not sure if that makes a difference but I just want to make that clear right now so it brews the splash herbing potions and while that brews I'm going to show you um, in which hoppers you want to put which ingredients now this is facing west so in other directions it might be different but you want to put the first ingredient which in this case for splash arming two potions is netherwort you want to put it in this hopper up here the second ingredient in this case glistening melon this hopper here next ingredient which is fermented spider eyes you want to put in this one glowstone here and gum powder there and so now let's see if this potion is finished brewing yet it's not, so I'll cut this and be back to you guys when this potion is finished brewing. Okay guys, so the potion is just about finished brewing. And as you can see, we now have three splash potion of harming two potions here. So now to empty those potions in that chest and refill with water bottles, just stand here for a second. As you can see, it refills with the water bottles. So now that the potions are in this chest, I'm going to show you guys how to build it. Over here in this chest, you can see all the supplies that you need now the only thing that's changed is this block which is just the basic building block you don't need that many but it may change how you just want to fill in the side so i decided to put it all there so let's just grab all of these ingredients so that we can start building so the first thing you want to do is place the block down here put it there place the block here torches on both sides Build a chest here, put some blocks here, chest on top, and now you want a brewing stand here, you want to remove this block, place a hopper there, you want to put a block here, here, and so you can get your droppers to fit in, one there, one there, now let's try to fit the droppers up on top. Put that there. Now you want to get a dropper up here. Just like that. And now you most certainly want to put a hopper into the chest here. So that's good. Now you want to put a button on here. Pressure plate here. And now it's time for some more of the wiring. You want to put a torch here. A block above it. A torch on this a block above it now you want to get redstone on top of that block you want to place a block up there to remove that now this is very important here you have to put a half slab here otherwise it will not work so just put a half slab right there another block on top there finish the redstone there now you just got to finish the aesthetics you want to place that there that there remove that and build this here so that looks good there now you want to fill in the glass up on top of here remove that and you want to place your last hopper right on top of the brewing stand just like that and that is how you build my version of Queen King Happy's compact brewing station I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and I'll see you all next time goodbye